Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Tech It and today we're going to build a force field. So I've done a little bit of work. What's more accurate is I left something on the line. Oh, we can see that. We need a ton of those today. But I left this world in line and set up another quarry. As you can see, it's almost finished. If we look down here, got one block to go. Um, yeah, that suit of armor had no armor actually equipped it because I was flying around. That quarry needs to pick it up fast. But as you can see, well, we just like forget about that for a second. This quarry is pumping out resources like crazy, seeing that's going max power. It's just, I've been watching just the resources come through here, and it's been a steady flow like this. Not so much this row, seeing that this is more when you get down lower, but it's had like these resources on it forever. Been crazy. Um, is it picking up my stuff? I hope it does. It should come around, um, should probably try and get it myself, but I don't know how to get down. Uh, and then I've got to get up. Getting up won't be hard, so I'll just grab, like, a bucket of water. So I'll, that's all I need, hopefully. Uh, bucket? Oh yeah, by the way, I did a couple of extra things too. I got import cables so these chests wouldn't fill up. They automatically import into the system. And I also got some more of that and made a wireless terminal system. Just so I can access the items from whenever and just dump it whenever. So, yeah. I did that off camera just because I just needed to make a ton more little things. Wasn't anything too exciting. Precious the quarry should try and come after this. What is that? I can't see whatsoever. Um. I don't know what to do about that. I hope the quarry picks that stuff up. I hope I didn't just blow up my boots. Otherwise, I'll probably just get that off camera if that did happen. Um, I hope that didn't happen, because that would be a pain. Of course, in traditional me, I forgot to set a timer. Um, I'll quickly set a timer and like kind of walk over there. Don't see my irons coming through yet. Oh, well, this is crazy. Okay, the quarry was about to pick up all my stuff. I'm hoping. Because I don't know how to light up the area without my torch fling. I guess I could grab torches, but, um, yeah. Come on. Slow body. Why am I so slow? Shouldn't I be able to sprint? String. There's my stuff. Oh, it's a ridiculous amount of stuff. Okay, it doesn't pick up everything. I can go down there and grab it now. Oh, 
Okay, let's grab pretty much all my stuff. Still like one more thing that's missing. Bucket. Um, where is it? One thing. Did not pick it up. It's gone. I already lost my little wireless access panel. Oh well, it's not a big deal. It wasn't that expensive to make, either that or I missed it. Hopefully I missed it, because it would be nice to have it. Um, it would pop out in this chest once it goes through the system. I'll check this in a while. Uh, I got some cobblestone, which isn't too bad. I can just chuck that in the system, because I ran out of cobblestone in the system. Um, so... This, what is called, is a modular force field. So, for the first part, we need steel. A lot of it, which... 64, 64? Yeah. Prioritize that, what's in here? Ferris, don't need it right now. Yeah, there we go. Pick up steel. So I'm not going to make that much steel. This modular force field system is really expensive, but I reckon it's cool, so we're going to make it. Check touches. What? Um. Modular force field system. So I'll grab this. Oh, I need a couple of these. A uh, stack of it. Six. Okay, that's uh, probably won't be enough. I think I might need like a wood farm sometime soon. So I'm always running out of wood. Do I know a stone? Hmm. I need like another furnace, honestly. No, you're not smelling that, you're smelling that. Hello? Still dust. Okay, um. What do I need? I need stone smells. Start smelting in here. Yeah, my chicken coop's kind of overflowing right now, like extremely overflowing. Because I've got that many chickens in it and it's filled up. I don't really need that food anymore. I'll take the run flesh, but yeah. Do I have any run flesh in here? I've got tons of ender pearls. There we go. Tons of food. Yeah, also, I've finally got an uh, infinite amount of ender, so I'm just collecting the ender pills right now. Probably just throw them out if I have nothing to do with them. But yeah. And I also found out, this system here, bites isn't actually equivalent to one item. It's like equivalent to, I don't know, two, four? But yeah, I didn't realise that at first. Oh, there it is. I knew it would come through. So yeah, this just allows me to put stuff in and draw stuff out. Okay, all steel's going back into the system. Five, ten. Ah. That should be enough, shouldn't it? So, <laughs> modular force field system. Craft a couple of those, free. Okay. How many of these can I craft right now? Stack already? Wait, how much did... So, 16, 30... I use 4 diamonds, yeah. This is very diamond heavy, if you haven't already noticed. So we need one of these. Force field capacitor. And a force field projector. That's not all. We also need... The modules for it. So, 
I figured out I need 16 of these. One, two. 16 of these. A couple of speed modules, which speed modules are fairly expensive. Which I think I need. Hmm. Pretty sure it was like 20. Okay. Speed modules. I'll just take it out one by one just so I don't waste too many. Okay, that's extremely expensive. We also need dome, which is more of these. So, a dome, because I want a dome. Force field, you can make so many ones, but dome. I reckon dome looks the best and more force fieldy to my liking. So, I've got a sphere. But they'll also do underneath. So we don't want underneath. We just want a dome. So we need to build a dome module. Um, rest of these can just go into speed if I have enough. So I'm pretty sure that's all I needed. Okay. If already. If I already used up all a stack of. I kind of used up a stack already. Seems like I have. I didn't realize it smelted so quickly. Yeah, it does smelt f smelt fairly fast. Uh. Now this force field is quite power heavy, but not too bad. It's doable. Okay. Is that enough? Oh, I need like one more. So this is like. Very like trial and everything. So I got everything here. So how this works. So you place down this will send a laser. So I need to find like the middle of my base. Okay, so two because this will emit from wherever the middle is. Is that right? Two, two. Okay, is my is my base not have a center? Let's see. No, but what's the closest I can get to the center? There. These lights are handy to mark out, turns out. So we've got the one that goes there. This one goes there, this one. So. Why is this like... <laughs> anyway. Like here we'll probably do. So this is where the force field projector will be. This is where the force field gets projected from. This driver is what powers everything, so all the power should go into this. Now this last thing I'll place maybe up a bit higher. You'll see what I mean when I place it up a bit higher. Because I kind of want the laser to go overhead. This thing projects like a laser. Uh, so yeah. It down. Zombie, I don't want to play. Sorry. Don't worry. So, we turn this on, and yeah, it turns blue. And to, so we need to get a laser to travel from here to here. So we just turn this on, and it should automatically send up a laser. It's already sent it to the final destination. So, for this design that I need, I'm pretty sure I need that many speed upgrades. I hope. Hey. So the speed upgrades in this thing 
is making it draw power far faster from this. So yeah. Now, here. We turn this on, it won't do anything. It will project nothing. So what I want is a scale upgrade. So these things will make the force field larger. So then I want to put a dome upgrade. So I'll put the sphere upgrade in there, which will start making the force field. But I only want it to make the dome. Then if I put this in, it should start building a force field. And this is high, so down. One, two. As soon as you make any changes, it will restart. By the looks of it, we're not getting enough power to it. So we need more speed upgrades. Yeah. Yeah, more speed upgrades is necessary. This is why I want the force field. It's all these zombies. Okay. So I need the force plating. Make a stack. Then... Oh, that's why it wasn't working. Okay. Grab as many as I can make. Eleven. Please be enough. Okay, that's... That's still not enough. I need this on the ground by the looks of it too. This isn't working right now. Can I break this? Please tell me I can break this. Um. Do I need to turn this off? Do I need to build a diamond pick? Jeez, I'm running out of diamonds. Ugh, that hurts. No? Can I break that diamond pick down at all? I could potentially build another quarry, but not now. Uh, anyway, I can play. Mm. Yeah, well, I need more speed upgrades. It's annoying how much I need. I didn't expect to need this much. Okay, I don't see me needing any more. Um, uh, is there any way at a modular? Okay, remote control. Ooh, card, infant power card, link card. Oh, that's quite really uh frequency. There doesn't look to be any way to break this. I can work on that while off camera, but anyway, so if I turn this all back on, hopefully I'm gaining power. Sphere mode. Sphere mode. This isn't working for some reason. If 
really draining any power, so it's not that. Um, <gasps> frequency. I was meant to put in the upgrades. Turn this on. Should actually start constructing it. So yeah, I definitely need to move this down. But this dome is pretty big, so I reckon this should be adequate size. Yeah, that's pretty close to center, too. Wait, I need something else to do that, don't I? Um, how do I move it down? Dome module science, so collected module. Pretty sure it's one of these science collection invert uh, captivity camouflage block cylinder custom. Horse. Which one is it? Like axes? There's so many different things. Block altar. Okay. Force field fusion glow. Warm stabilizer. Speed shock. Invert. Inverts the field to use negative space. Collection. Silencer. Dome. Rift. Section do R and um, what is it? It's something can anyway. This is Jesus, that's just big enough. This dome. So, if I could just quickly look at what I was looking at, um, where is it? It is um uh which one is it? Oh, I must go. It's transform. Okay, so that uses a ton more. I need more steel. That's crazy. Uh, smelting up that steel. Just need a couple more pieces. So I need a, uh, what you call it? And modular. So I need this one. So for this one, I need a couple of these. If I actually got where I want it. So for this one, I need this. I'm like out of diamonds now. Two of those. Gonna have both of those, so I need to move you down to two more down two more. That should give me exactly where I want it. Yeah, perfect. Now, this will slowly reconstruct. So, this doesn't seem to be using too much power actually. I reckon I only needed about half of those speed modules, which is a pain to know that. But I can chuck these into here, build faster. That's not it. There you go. Dome's constructed. Yeah, and that's. It's always like, is un really unstable. I don't know why, but this force field stuff's really unstable. But if we look, 
right th those little lights that are stopping it from fully creating this force field is operational oh that's so cool it's even going rid of the water so with this force field nothing can get through besides players right now i don't have any other players in the server so i don't need to worry about otherwise so how it works is simply if you want to get through this force field you can't break it the only way to do it is to you can't even walk through it is to shift walk through it okay and sometimes it just doesn't work Or it just doesn't want to work. Anyway, we can just turn it on and off if we want it to sh shut down. We won't turn off that one. Turn off this one. And we can go. But otherwise, if we're just in our base, turn on our construct. Seeing that I've got all the speed modules, it'll activate in a couple of seconds. We don't need to worry about monsters. I do want to expand the size of this, though. So, modular, I want this. Size one scale two more should easily do it. Is that still running okay? Yeah, that's still running okay. Okay, that's a bit better. Uh, I do want it larger though. I hope that one scale is that. So uh, we probably have so little diamonds right now. We won't worry about that, though. Okay, that's hurting us a bit more. Whoa, that's a good size now. So, how's the power going? So, the power's perfect at that. It just drains a bit of power when being constructed, but this is our force field now. I'll clear out all these trees in the way, light up this area, and probably pave over this lake off camera and yeah this is perfect for what we want I can even see straight through the water so I probably just like completely enclose all that water destroy those trees that are like here that light can go I'll probably just clean up all the lights in this area because like look at this platform it's getting crazy so yeah Oops. So, get the rest of it. See you, everybody, and yeah, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and yeah, see you in the next episode. Bye.